What's going on everybody? It's Patrick Midtown Doors. Come back. I got something to show you. Okay, so let's open it up, and I will say she is, sti is stiff when you first open it up. There's the little tag for it uh, that came on it, Apache 3800. Uh, they make three sizes in these things. Uh, this is the intermediate. They show it with uh, two pew-pews in it. We won't mention that anymore on the channel. Well, we will. Um, but this is what I did with it, was put my good knives in it um to keep them safe and keep them you know from out of my underwear drawer basically that was why so i keep this in my closet i've got a camera case i keep in there it's a hard shell case kind of like this i've got to reconfigure it because i want to do some stuff with it with this camera and some other cameras but basically i've got my knives laid out and i've actually got them laid out by brand so start out with i've got my uh all my spider co's in here I've got a missing spider co. I don't know how long it's been missing, but it's been missing for quite a while. Then I got all my CRKTs running through here, my one Civivi. Then I get into my Gerber knives. I have a lot of Gerber stuff. Didn't realize I did, but I do. Uh, then we got SOG. I got a couple SOGs, a Leatherman, my one um, Swiss Army, the, my Benchmade. Then we get into Kershaw's, I ended up, I've got a lot of Kershaw's. I got uh, Buck Knife. Then there's my, my um, uh, Ontario Rat. I put a blue liner on it, just playing around. Then I've got uh, spots for one, two, three, four, five more knives. Then the old knives that I've got in here, these are my dad and my grandfather's knives. Um, I just got them in here. This one, I mean, it's pretty bad shape, but it stays in there. It's an old, um, no, I can't even see it right now. But then this is my grandfather's old case, double X. I don't know if you can see that again. You can tell how cold it is in my closet. These things are frosting up. That's funny. Um, the mistake I made when I did this and put it together, this is the way I should have done it to begin with. The way I did it to, I was not skipping, um, what I, okay, let me start over. So what I did over here on this side, I went to the edge and then I skipped to, because these all come out in sections. Um, and they're pre-cut. You have to do a little bit of cutting. I did, um, I've got a knife that I just cut you know kind of cut the perforations at and pulled it out but um, what I did here is I did one skip two did another one skip two all the way down here I was trying to do it in the beginning do one skip one and what I found out is this is getting too flimsy uh, but what I did do to kind of fix that problem is I super glued it back on itself so the way I did it, like I said, beginning, um, there's the first perforation. So I took that one out, skipped to, took the next one out, and it holds these knives perfect. I dare say the thickest one probably is this one, is this CRKT. Um, that's the thickest knife in the collection of my good knives, my really, really good knives and stuff I don't want to I want to try to keep track of so anyway so um, I've got uh, I do have six more spots to put more knives in at some point which I probably will but right now this is it this is my knife collection it stays in this thing um, it's got the nice eggshell foam up here and of course this is foam um, I, I would take all these out but this goes all the way through and you have another layer of this stuff at the very bottom but this is two layers thick, so if that gives you any idea, um, 
how thick it is. Uh, let's see. Well, if you know the paramilitary, how thick that knife is, or long it is, that's far down as it goes. So anyways, guys, it's a real quick, you know, overview of it. Like I said, there's a bunch of other people that have done reviews on this thing and has this on their channel. I wanted to get it and see what the case is like. Um, I think it's pretty pretty cool little case. Locks down. It does the um, right here open and close valve uh, securely before getting wet. Oh, okay. That makes sense. That opens. Let's there out. That closes. Okay. So anyway, I don't know much about them. You can lock it on both ends. And get you a couple different locks put on it. Right now, it's just going to stay in my closet and uh, keep my knives. Keep my knives from beating beat up in my underwear drawer. <laughs> so, anyways, uh, just real quickie. I like this little thing. It's pretty neat. Uh, I sat here all day Saturday pulling these things out to put the knives in and put them in their home for now. But I think this is going to work out pretty good and keep them nice and clean and all that good stuff. All right, guys, that's it for now. I'm rambling at this point. Uh, have a good Saturday. Be prepared.